Smiley! What's up, Adam? What's going on, buddy? Nothing much. Uh, we're back for another weekly episode here at the Mountain Bike Shed. Uh, it's a very in- important, very special episode. Um, one of the greatest episodes we'll do all year. It's our Father's Day special. So we all have fathers, or some of us are fathers. Yep. Soon to be fathers, maybe, in 10, 15, 20, 35 yep. years. Yep. Um, we've got Linda. That's one of my children. I also have a <laughs> teenage daughter. Um, but Linda is my other child. She's on camera. She's always here at the shop. People should come see her. She loves visiting with friends. Her father, actually, um, she only knew him for about the first six six weeks of her life. And mm-hmm. then um, her father was gone past there. So um, Linda is here. Give her some pets. We are open on Father's Day. On Sundays, we're open 12 to 4, limited time. But you can come see us then. Um, so I thought for tonight's episode, it would be really cool if we we both picked out five items at the shop here, um, things we thought our dads would love, um, gifts we could get our dad. So, um, you know, everybody watching this is probably a mountain biker. Maybe you're not. We've got a lot of really cool stuff in this shop. So if you're a mountain biker and your dad's not, you can still come into the shop and buy a lot, a lot of really cool gifts. Um, did you pick out mountain bike related stuff or did you pick out some stuff maybe that wasn't? I had it work both ways. Yeah, because your dad is a mountain biker. He is, but like, you know, you want to get something that also shows what other people could get their dad, even if they aren't a mountain biker. Sure. Yep. I actually, I got so excited. We've got so much cool stuff in here that I thought as a father, here's things that I would love. Mm -hmm. So I actually didn't pick anything mountain bike related. My stuff's all (laughs) non-mountain bike related. So if you're a mountain biker, come in, shop for your dad for Father's Day. You don't have to go to Walmart or any of these other stores. You can get something awesome for your dad here, no matter what he does. Um, we do have the close-up camp, so we can yeah. show everybody that. Right now, we've got our Red Bulls on there. Every Saturday here at the shop, we do free Red Bull Saturday, 8-ounce Red Bull Saturday. You don't have to purchase anything in store in order to do that. Uh, you can just grab a Red Bull from us. So, right away, let's hop right into it. Let's get into let's what get is right your first it. item that you are getting that you would get your dad for Father's Day here first at the Mountain First item Club. I wanted to show is 510. Freerider Pros. Ooh. Now, here's the thing. Let's put up this up on the close up. You know what I'm saying? Got them on the close up. Here's the thing. It doesn't have to be a mountain bike shoe. Overall, this is a rugged shoe. Hiking, whatever. It's gonna have uh, toe protection here, so you're not gonna be breaking no toes. But also, this rubber. So I've also like when we were building my house, when I'd get up on the roof, I'd always be putting on the five tens because they have good grip. Mm -hmm. Overall, it's a good work shoe. It's good if I'm ever working or something. It's leather. It's a nice shoe. So I would get that. That doesn't even have to be a mountain bike gift. Yeah, this is the Freerider Pro. So they were 150 bucks. They have really stiff sole, so really good sport. Transfer through um, a lot of power there um, as far as getting to the pedals. But there's also the Trail Cross from 510 that we sell. The Trail Cross is meant as a hiking and a biking shoe. So that could be a really good option as well. They're all going to be waterproof. They're going to withstand the elements. So that's a really great choice. If your dad is a mountain biker and he doesn't have a set of 510 Freerider Pros, maybe he's running regular Freeriders, maybe he's got some other off-brand or something, get him the Pros and he will notice on his first ride like, oh, I just got stronger on my bike. This is There's amazing. a difference. There's a difference. Yeah, people don't realize that always. So cool. So the Freerider Pro was your first one. Yep. Um, let me, let, we'll go back, back and forth. Yep, that's so what now we I'll do. do one. Um, so I actually grabbed the, um, this is a Casio watch. This does, this is a compass. I'm going to throw it up on screen. Um, so this is the SGW 100 dual sensor digital watch in navy and orange. So all of our wheels up guys, you should definitely be getting your dad or maybe your coach. And you know, our coaches are sometimes like father figures to us. Pretty much. So, you know, maybe anybody on like the wheels up enduro team should be thinking, what should I be getting my coaches for Father's Day? Feels kind of directed. <laughs> <laughs> so they could get one of their coaches one of these great digital compasses. So right. um, this has got the negative display. We saw a lot of different Casio watches here. Some are less sporty looking. I thought this one was cool. Every dad could use a watch. Yeah. If my daughter would have ever gotten me a watch for Father's Day, I would I would have been like, this is amazing. How thoughtful. And even if you're, you don't know if your dad's into watches or something mm-hmm. like that, every dad wants this. It'll tell them the temperature. It'll tell him um, compass reading, and it'll tell him the time. So Very dads nice. love, dads are always doing stuff. 
we've got things going on. We're always doing something. We need to know what time it is. So especially if your dad does not wear a watch, get him this. If your dad does wear a watch, get him this because uh, this is waterproof. It's durable. Yeah. So maybe dad wears a nice watch. Maybe he's got a Rolex. Maybe he's got um, something that's been passed down from his father. Get them the digital, the tough Casio watch from the shed. We've got over 40 different options here. Right. This one's $69.95. It's actually one of the more expensive watches that we sell um, from Casio. But we do have some options that start at uh, $29.95, $24, yep. $25. So you can get something for dad that he can throw on when he's working out in the yard, um, when he's fixing your car for you, when he's going over to your sister's house. Um, to help fix her plumbing, mm -hmm. he can throw on his, I almost just closed our screen. <laughs> I pressed the button, it didn't do anything. So yeah, that was mine. I like the watches. So we do have a ton of watches, all the way from $20 up to our GPS smartwatches, health monitoring, all that stuff. I mean, you could spend thousands or you can get your dad into a digital Garmin fitness watch with heart rate monitors and GPS. <laughs> um, you could do those things. So. Um, I chose the watch. All right, Riley, what's your next item? We're on the watch topic. Yeah. So here's the thing with, like, my uh, my selection. I have it where, like, th this is the watch I'm going to get. Ooh. Let's show it. But basically, this is, like, the nice stuff, and then this is the expensive part, and the rest are kind of, like, cool other gifts. You know yeah. what I'm saying? The mm -hmm. 510s are also pretty nice, too. Very nice. Riley went with the Instinct crossover. So this is very, it's got kind of that G-Shock look to it. That's right. Um, which is very nice. The Garmin Instinct crossovers, at least for through this week, they're on sale 100 bucks off. Ho, ho, so people, ho. Could, people could pick up an Instinct, just a regular Instinct, not the crossover with the hands, uh, but a regular Instinct for $249. The crossovers is what I wear. I like it because it's got the actual real hands on it. These are a little mm -hmm. bit pricier. The Instinct Crossover Solar is going to run you closer to $599. Um, but even your standard Instinct that you can get dad for $249 bucks that we have available here at the shed. That's right. Um, that is going to uh, provide heart rate for him. It's going to give him his sleep scores. Um, it's going to um, tell him his stress levels throughout the day. So find out how much mom is you know, bothering with the chores. How, hard, <laughs> how high did his heart rate get because of that? Um, all those great things that can now keep track of without having to think about it. And the really important thing, I think a lot of times when we think about our dads and Linda's sleeping, she doesn't, she doesn't really have a sleep score. Um, she would, she would be at 100% body be 100%. battery <laughs> and really good sleep scores. But a lot of times with dads, they're like, oh, my dad had an Apple watch. Mm. He never wore it. I don't know about getting him a Garmin. This might be a bad idea, but the nice thing, especially with the Instinct Crossover, this has got what they call a MIPS display on it. So with right. the MIPS display, it's just black and white, which means it's not going to take as much power as these like Apple Watches, the bright colors and all this nonsense oh, yeah. going on. Dad can turn notifications off or he can limit his notifications on his watch. My Instinct Crossover Solar has a 24-day battery. That's good. So your dad's going to make it multiple weeks, weeks with an Instinct. Even if it's not solar, you're still going to get 20-day battery out of it. So dad doesn't have to charge his watch for two weeks. He's going to love it. He's going to be able to wear it in the shower. He can wear it at the lake when he's boating. He can wear it in the water. He can wear it doing whatever he's doing. He can beat it up. I yep. slam my into all kinds of stuff around Me here too, all day yeah. long. Doesn't care. So yep. beautiful choice with the crossover. Dads will love that because it's so tough. Uh, the Instinct line of the Garmin's, again, starting at $249 right now. They're on sale in shop um, or $599 for the, the Instinct crossover solar. So very cool choice. Yeah. Very I will good. say one thing, too. With the watch I'm wearing right now, uh, yep. what's cool about this one is I've never had a die on me, and all I do is right when I'm about to take a shower, I just plug it in, and mm -hmm. then when I'm done with the shower, I put it on, and I've never had anything happen. It's yep. been good battery for, like, ever. I've never had a die, so... That's what's really cool about those. And not to spend too much time on the Garmin stuff, but it, it has helped me a lot. Since I've been able to start monitoring this, I've realized my heart rate gets elevated every time I stand. Mm -hmm. um, I've also purchased Garmin for $199. They have a wireless Bluetooth uh, blood pressure monitor as well. Mm -hmm. So I'm able to use that. It's been really handy with my doctor and, and helping me kind of figure out what's going on with my body post my head injury. Um, so that's really nice. And then, I wear my Instinct Crossover almost every day, but I do love watches like the Bulova. We do have some higher end watches here at the shop too. That's right. We've got some really classy, just legit luxury watches that start at $95 here in Shed. Mm -hmm. um, but I like to wear my, my regular watches like this Precision is Chronograph. 
but I don't want to not be monitoring my level. So I have the Vivo Fit from Garmin. We sell these in shop as well. They're $149. You could just get dad something as simple as this. He can send his notifications to it. It's going to do sleep tracking and all that. The difference between something that's $149 in the mm -hmm. Garmin line to like your kind of $300 plus units is the, it's going to have different heart rate sensors. You're actually going to get a little bit better readings from the yeah. higher end ones than you will with this, but this still gets the job done. Yeah. You know, I'll wear it for a couple days in a row. I'll wear it to bed. Again, this goes in the shower. It does anything I need it to do. Mm -hmm. yep. So I have two Garmin's. I switch between them. So that, cause I don't want to wear two watches at the same time. Yeah. <laughs> so I kind of am with this, but nobody seems to be giving me any trouble. That's right. So I can wear my regular watches. Let's which see is the right. next gift. All right. So mine, oh, I did get something bike related. You so, liar. You said you didn't. Um, if my dad was a cyclist or my dad does like to use the stationary bike at home, Mm -hmm. um, but he's got uh, thick thighs. He's a thick thighed fella. Um, so <laughs> he gets a little bit of chafing, but uh, this is the Benice chamois. So the Benice chamois, I'm sure you guys have seen me talk about them. Um, it's got this extra little pouch in the front for dad. So what dads need is a little bit extra space. We don't, no one wants to see their dad adjusting around and whatnot on the trail. So beneath is the only chamois out there that has this is not a, it's kind of a gross picture for you guys, but <laughs> <laughs> but it's a regular chamois. It's got a super nice pad on the inside. Um, and then they've got what they call, I'll show you guys just this. So really nice chamois, but they've got my package technology. So my, they don't even show a good picture of it on here. Um, but my package technology is gonna give dad a little bit of room up front. Um, these are amazing. They're somewhere in the $70 range. We've got all sizes of them. If your dad's a cyclist um, or if your husband or whatever it may be is a cyclist, for Father's Day, get them these. Dad doesn't know he needs these yet. They're absolutely amazing. We used to sell their boxer briefs here too. It's all I wear. They do not move around. We're going to pick those back up here soon. Um, I don't have them in shop this week, so just the cycling chamois now. But you can get these without the pad, just as regular boxer briefs. Yep. Life-changing. It is changing. amazing it, <laughs> to think that they've been making chamois for who knows how long for bikes and that nobody made room for gentlemen on the front of their chamois. Right. We've just been uh, just uncomfortable riding our bikes. It's absolutely amazing. So get your dad these chamois. He doesn't know he needs these, but he will absolutely love them. All right. Linda, still not impressed. She, she doesn't does. wear a chamois when she rides bikes. She's slumped. Yeah. She wears a collar sometimes. Oh, you woke her up. Oh, she looks like a bat in the picture. Look at that. <laughs> oh, it's out there, Sweeney. Oh, Linda. Oh, it's my turn. All right, Riley, what else do we got? This is a good one. This is a good one. Some Ooh. Fox swim trunks. So these are just a bicycle swim trunks. These aren't yep. Fox. Um, so these are very neat. It's got a, a bicyclist on yes. the, the shorts. He's wearing a full face helmet. So um, as we know, dads, I got you back on the big screen. Dads love um, going out on the boat. They love going on the yep. water. They like steering the boat. They like throwing kids off the tubes. That's right. Um, they like river days where they're fishing. Dads love all this stuff. So why not get him a pair of shorts that uh, lets everybody know like, hey, this guy's into it. That's right. So I also went with a pair of swim trunks <laughs> oh for dad. Oh my gosh. So we're both on the same page here. Because here's the thing, we're dads, we don't like shopping. We it's like going to the deal. bike shop, that makes sense if we're cyclists, but dads in general don't like shopping. We don't know where to get swim trunks at unless mom gets them. Well, if mom gets them, they're not gonna be the right size. So it's nice if you guys can get dad some, some trunks. We have all kinds of different styles from Fox. Some of them are a little bit simpler. We have ones that come way above the kind of mid thigh, or these are a little bit longer. These are gonna be like a, a 15 inch. I did pick up the the double XL because, like I said, mm -hmm. my dad, um, he's a he's he's a thick gentleman, so um, <laughs> he would need those. These have a little motocross guy on them. Um, these are an 18 inch length. We have them all the way down to an 11 inch length. Um, so that's really neat. People should get their dad. I mean, dads never buy swim trunks for themselves. They don't right. know how to do that. So all right, move on to your next one. All right. We got. And the then Fox we just got hat. two more items. We should be able to wrap them up. Yeah. All right, so you got the fox hat there. Um, fox hats are really good for dads, so 
That would be a do your last item so you can help the customer. Right. So yeah, get that a fox hat. Get that a fox hat. And then we got, hold up, the fox shirt. Oh, fox shirt. Oh, so, you gotta give him an outfit, you know? Um, these fox shirts are one of my favorite. These are, these are true fit or dry fit, so they actually yep. stretch and breathe. Um, so that's really nice. So get that a nice dry fit shirt. Riley's gonna right. bust off. He's gonna help the customer that just walked in because we recorded this before we closed today. <laughs> and so I'll wrap up my last two items and I'll let you guys go for the rest of the evening. Um, a cool one I got to try out this weekend was the Exploder Ball. So um, we do carry golf supplies here at the Mountain Bike Shed now. If dad needs a, a set of gloves, if he needs a towel, tees, balls, anything along those lines, uh, we do carry them, but then we have plenty of these gag balls. So. Uh, if your dad does like to go golfing or if he's doing any charity tournaments this year, um, give him one of these. He can sneak these on the tee to one of his, his buddies in the group. Um, if you check our, our reels or shorts, uh, we do have a video of these operating. A lot of different kind of gag balls other than the exploder, some unputtable balls, some other things to really throw their friends off. So dads like playing jokes on each other. Um, so get them the exploding balls to really make sure they have a fun weekend. And then... Lastly, we've got the Quick Cover. Um, Quick Cover's a local company here out of, out of Wentzville, Missouri. Um, really nice. These hold in place very well. I have bucket seats on all my cars. Um, and there's kind of little grippers to hold it into place, a strap on the back. Um, so any dad, whether he mountain bikes or if he just does something, these easily slip on. They're machine washable. Um, and your dad's able to keep his car seats clean. Um, so get these for him, um, really nice thing to kind of make his life a little bit easier. So that's it for this week's episode. Tune in next week. We'll be back. Go subscribe over on YouTube. We did make it over 300. So Riley gets to stay on the podcast. That's why you're seeing them this week. Um, like the video, share it and check us out next week.